Okay, um, this is Chevy Girl. I This is the first time I've ever filmed anything with my camera. I'm going to check it out and see how well it does and um, see if I might want to keep using it or get a video camera. Uh, what I have here is my tackle box that my dad had. I spray painted after I cleaned it up. I've been trying to find a bag that um, would hold different things. I'm going to show you what's all in there. And I can't find a bag, so I'm just going to stick with my tackle box. I just find it the easiest thing to do. So, here's the bottom part. And the top drawer. You can see has some ink pads in it. I put my clear and my black. So I have those. And these are like the Martha Stewart ones right there. These are the color box, color box ones. I got these from Tuesday morning for like a dollar nine nine. That was really cool. So I got different colors of those. As you will see, my stickles are just kind of st stuffed everywhere in here, along with some embossing powder and my undo. Sorry if the camera is wiggly. Okay, these are my doodle book block. I don't have the small ones. Um, I have the big jars. This is more, the little ones like this are embossing powder. You can buy these at Joann's. More cat eye or color blockings. I don't have space in the top drawer for those. And here's all my stickles. Because I wasn't using any of this stuff. It was in a cabinet and it wasn't getting used. And I thought, man, I really want to get this stuff used. So I put it here. Over here, I've got my pop dots. More stickles. Lots of glitter. I actually have the big jars of these and I also bought the small ones. So I just decided to put the small ones in here. And it was saving more room. Because most of the time I'm going to use my stickles anyway. And of course here's the more embossing powder that I need to use. And my stamp cleaner. And my bone folder. That's the only place that bone folder will fit. Except for in the top. Okay. Right here we have stuff like my uh, liquid applique more embossing powder, tools, like my tweezer bees, glue, edge distressers, pencils, markers, uh, white markers, pencils, an embossing pen, uh, of course my Cricut spatula that I need when I get my Cricut. And that's pretty much what's down there. And it just locks back. You can actually put a lock right there if you wanted to to keep little kids out, which mine know better. And then the top part right here just unfastens like this. It flips over. And inside I have my, my trimmer, my Xyron tape runner glue dots, my ATG tape, my acid free stuff for when I'm doing newspapers and stuff like that, baby powder because you never know when you might want to make a sticker um, pop dotted so you can use baby powder for that. And I've got some embossing powder, uh, excuse me, flock that I don't have the doodle bug colors for which is green, navy, um, and brown. I don't have those colors in Doodlebug. Another edge distressor. My heat emboss gun and some blocks that I need. I have different sizes in there. And then, of course, and here's my brown and my black and my matte to do piercing. That's all stuff in there. And this is my. Let's set the camera down. This is my making memory one, so I just keep it 
back in there and I'll just flip the top over and I like how it's got some inside right here so that you can kind of pile it up a little bit and not worry about stuff going in. My other project that I worked on this morning was my cropping style. It's supposed to like hold photos but I always get tired of my embellishments just going everywhere. So I did this. Let's see y'all can see. Um, I put stuff like my flowers. And bling. You know, I've also got my basic embellishments. You can get these at Hobby Lobby. I usually get them when they're half off. I think they're like $14, $15, something like that. And I usually get them when they're like $7, something, seven fifty. And my flowers is just a collection of flowers. And see, I have the primary, the creamy ones. There's my primary. Here's the bright ones. And of course, here's the creamy ones. And here's some more gemstones. weird how it folds up, but it does work. At least it's all together and I don't have to worry about it being all in my bottom of my bag and spilling out everywhere. So anyway, that's my first video. Hope you enjoy it and I look forward to maybe trying another one soon. Thank you.